Brett, give us a little bit of, of your background, but also I saw you writing some notes there. There was a couple of words used there that I thought were quite interesting, especially considering what I know about you. The word God was used a few times. Well, uh, let me just say I'm an evolutionary biologist and probably for the purposes of this conversation, it would be best to think of me as a complex systems theorist. One of the things that I believe is true about AI is that this is the first time that we have built machines that have crossed the threshold from the highly complicated into the truly complex. And I will say I'm listening to this conversation with a, um, a, a mixture of profound hope and dread mm -hmm. because it seems to me that it is obvious that the potential good that can come from this technology is effectively infinite. But I would say that the harm is probably 10 times. It's a bigger infinity. And the question of how we are going to get to a place where we can leverage the obvious power that is here to do good and dodge the worst harms, I have no idea. I, I know we're not prepared. So I hear you talking about agents and I think um, that's marvelous. We can all use such a thing right away and the more powerful it is, the better the idea of something that can solve problems on your behalf while you're doing something else is marvelous. But of course, that is the precondition for absolute devastation to arise out of a miscommunication, right? To have something acting autonomously to accomplish a goal, you damn well better understand what the goal really is and how to, how to pull back the reins in the event that it starts accomplishing something that wasn't the goal. 